to be completely honest with you, you know, for, for the last few years, I've always heard, you know, be ready, be ready, be ready. Um, and so coming into this year, the first few games, um, it was, it was a little more the same, Hey, be ready when you get in, be ready. Um, but having the support that I have now and, and having guys that, um, you know, having teammates that, that back me up and, and the energy that I give, I pride myself in that, but it makes a huge difference when I have guys next to me who reciprocate that same energy, you know, and I think that's, that was a big thing tonight. Um, I, I definitely don't think it was, you know, I got to make stuff happen. Um, it, was, it was definitely, okay, I, here's what I can do. I can talk, I can, I can bring energy, um, but I, I wasn't going in looking to score, you know. Um, I mean, when you look at our team, uh, we got, if you go down the line, you got Terrell, who's just a tireless sh shooter, you know, just limitless range. You got Elijah, who can drive inside, you know, really disrupt things. Um, you know, you got Lamine, who can just make all these acrobatic plays. Um, and I could go down the list, but uh, you really look at the scouting report, and, uh, uh, you know, I'd imagine. The other coaches in the lo is in their their locker room before the game saying, "Oh yeah, you know, don't worry about him." So for me, it's kind of like an advantage, you know, um, to to kind of be overlooked, if you will, and then kind of it just adds more to it when I come in the game and I'm just I try to try to talk as much as I can and and not rush our our offense. Uh, try to try to play everything tr everything through. Uh, I think that's where the disruptiveness comes from. My role move, it, I sat down with Coach two days ago, right? And and I kind of just said thank you, you know, thank you because the role that I'm in right now, regardless of playing time, um, I get to be that fifth-year guy. I get to be that guy who, who, you know, sees the game a little differently, see, you know, knows the pace, and uh, – I just have other guys on the team this year that are receptive to what I'm trying to what I'm trying to teach, and it goes both ways, you know. So as far as roles, I'm not too worried about you know being in the game the entire time, or, or maybe there's a game I do, another game that I don't play, you know. That'll be for a reason, you know. It's uh, it's like special teams on on football, you know. There's there's reasons uh, for 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 everything. I think. I think especially in these first few games, there's definitely been getting those jitters out, uh, you know, and it was, I had that myself tonight, you know, that first minute and a half, after that, the game slowed down, you know, okay, you know, let's stay in what we're doing, you know, I don't know if, if you go back, you'll probably see, you know, I'm not as jumpy, you know, I'm not, I'm not jumping at certain things, I'm, I slow down a little more, you know, I'm more solid, um, on, especially on defense. You know, um, so yeah. Uh, no, of, of course. Uh, you know, we go into the locker room, and and coach said, "Hey, look, uh, you know, we gotta we gotta keep going because we'd already been in this situation before, um, and so we knew that they're going to be even more scrappy. That they're gonna come out and hit first. Same thing that happened with LMU. LMU, we kind of went into halftime like, you know, okay." We're going to win this. And kind of coming out with that mentality, we came out and, and they, were, they went full force, you know, and, and we just kind of reacted to it, uh, you know, too late, a little too late. Um, so for today, a little more the same, not as bad. We had the lead. I think in the first, uh, I think it was the first four or six minutes, you know, we won that, that time, that short time period. You know, we won that first six minutes. Um, and so then our goal, and the guys were talking about it on the bench, and our goal was to win the next six minutes. And so once we got to, like, where the third quarter would be, that's when we kind of started to slow down and, and start making mistakes that otherwise we wouldn't, you know. Um, and that's, you know, they brought the pressure on, and, and so I'm just, I'm just glad. I mean, it, it got my heart... I know it got a lot of people energized. Um, you know, I'm just glad that we, that we were able to pull it off. So, definitely a high intensity, uh, high intensity moment.